today was my 20th birthday. May 10th, 2017, I turned 20. And honestly, this was a pretty big birthday for me in regards of no longer being a teenager. For most of my teenage years, I never felt like a teenager. I always felt grown up and all I wanted to do was grow up and not be a teenager anymore. And then my 19th year hit and I never felt more like a teenager in my life. And not sur or surprisingly enough, this is non-alcoholic. My mom got this for me. <laughs> it says birthday on it. Um, yeah. My 19th year was the one year where I felt my age, but at the same time, I still didn't because of my job, which is totally fine. I was editor-in-chief of my school's newspaper, which was an amazing thing to be at 19 years old. I actually had the interview for it on my 19th birthday, and then I was elected executive vice president of my university students union at 19 years old. So on that aspect, I never felt 19, I never felt like a teenager, everyone thought I was much older. But on the other aspect, 19, legal age in Canada, I experienced a whole new world of alcohol and partying and going to clubs and going to bars and it, it was fun, I, I'm not gonna lie, but now I'm 20 and this was the first birthday in history of birthdays where I did not feel like it was my birthday whatsoever. I'll walk you through the day. I woke up and I laid in bed until 7.40. Keep in mind I have to be at work at 8am. Thank god my work is a two minute walk. So I got ready, I pulled myself out of bed and I went to work. And it still didn't feel like my birthday even though everyone was wishing me a happy birthday and it was kind of nice and I was getting all these messages and Instagram post tag things and Facebook notifications um, that people were wishing me a happy birthday but it still didn't feel like my birthday. My awesome co-workers slash team members decorated one of our boardrooms and we had cake and they sang to me and it still didn't feel like my birthday and I stayed at work until almost 6 p.m. and my friends picked me up and sang me happy birthday and it still didn't feel like my birthday. I got my favorite thing ever which is my free birthday drink from Starbucks and just another day they wished me happy birthday at Starbucks and I totally threw them off because I didn't get my normal order but still didn't feel like my birthday. I went to my friend's house and it was decorated for my birthday and they gave me a cake and they got me a gift. Ironically enough, it was wrapped in Christmas stuff, but it still didn't feel like my birthday and I just, I don't know why. This was my first birthday away from home, maybe, but still didn't feel real and it's kind of crazy but the second half of this video I want to be about what I achieved throughout my first 20 years of life so so throughout my first 20 years of life I got my license I lost the most important person to me my grandmother I graduated from high school I moved to an island in the middle of nowhere and it was the best decision I have made this so far in my life. I did research for my first uh, department of my university before I figured out what I actually wanted to do with my life. I was Caper Times Editor-in-Chief. I facilitated labs. I am now Executive Vice President. I started a week ago. Over a week ago now. Actually, I started 10 days ago <laughs> and I've traveled. I've been to 16 or 17 of the states in America. I've been to 
five Canadian provinces and I want to travel more. <laughs> um, yeah, I've, it doesn't seem like a lot but those are like my big accomplishments I have so far and it's crazy to me that well, as my friend Caitlin said, one-fifth of my life is probably over, <laughs> but, yeah, I can't believe I'm standing here right now in this apartment, my college apartment. I would never would have guessed if you asked me three years ago if I, when I turned 17, if I thought I would be in Sydney, Nova Scotia at Cape Breton University doing a BA in communication followed by a BBA in legal studies. I never would have believed you. 17 years old, I plan on going to med school in America. Moving here was clearly the best choice for me. 19, cheers to you. You are the year of new opportunities which will continue on throughout life hopefully and knock on wood you're the year of great parties and you're the year that showed me that i can do anything i set my mind to so here's to my 20s i'm so excited to see what you have in store